Hi, today I'm going to talk to you about my new Blender add-on, which is Isolate. It aims at um, simplify and help for lighting in Blender. So let's start by installing it. Like any other Blender add-on, activate it in the user preference and save user settings. From there, you have a new button here. I'll talk about this a little later. But now, when you add any lamp, you have some additional buttons in this header in the 3D viewport. So I'll explain. When you have several lamps to light a scene in Blender, it's impossible to isolate one or the others by just a single click. You have to go to the outliner and deselect or toggle the visibility or the renderability of all the lamp you want to mute. So basically, that's the point of my add-on. You just have to select one and click here, isolate. And it will toggle every other lamp uh, in, the, in the scene. And if you click again, it will make them appear again. You can also toggle this, uh, this property in order to, when isolating, just to get the renderability of other lamps and to get back. You can make a multi-selection and it will work as expected. So it will just chip the, the two, two lamps you selected. And that's about it for the main functionality of the add-on. Oh yeah, and it works also with like mesh lights uh, in cycles. If you have uh, lights which have an emitting material, you can toggle it and isolate it as a, any lamp in the scene. So, okay, but you also have a nice feature which is an OpenGL helper. When you toggle this, you will see all the rendered lamp in your scene circled by this kind of square. The purple one is for lamp lamp and the blue one is for mesh light lamps. So here you have a list of this and uh, you can control click on one of these fellas to select it and you can see there's um, uh, R for rendered and V for visibility. Uh, you can also toggle help to be sure about this. So if you control click again on one of these, you can toggle the renderability and visibility from the viewport. And you can also, of course, isolate or de-isolate. So that's about it. Uh, there's some extras here like the size and the spacing of the of the info which are displayed. You have also the possibility to see or not see the unrendered um, unrendered lamps, unrendered lights. You can toggle this one to see all the scene or only the active layers lamps, and uh, you can toggle. Uh, this one for the lamps and this one for the mesh lights if you don't want to borrow with extra stuff. And another thing to know about the viewport helper is that you can have several 3D viewports. It will work but the interactive part of it will only work on the the one you launch the, the helper. Okay that's about it. You quit that OpenGL helper by hitting escape on your keyboard and uh, you have some extra preferences for the, the color in the viewport helper. Hope this add-on could be useful for some and sorry for my poor English.